morning and welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. I'm Mark and I'm going to take you for a walk around our 2009 Ford Falcon FG XR6 sedan today. We'll start off at the front of the car. A few things to just point out. There are a few uh, stone chips that have been touched up along the front of our bonnet, consistent with its age. A couple of minor touch-ups on our bumper bar as well. Being the XR6, we've got the body kit as well with our driving lights right down in the bottom of our front bumper. As we move around to the driver's side, um, as you can see, finished in brilliant black, presents quite well. Um, alloy wheels from factory, a couple of minor little scratches on our right-hand front alloy wheel. Um, and the odd minor little scratch just on our Juco on that front guard. Um, once again, consistent with its age. Colour-coded exterior mirrors and door handles. Once again, a few minor little cosmetic marks just, just to... Uh, point them out so that you're aware when you come out to have a look and a drive of this particular car. Our right hand rear alloy wheel is virtually unmarked. Really good treader on our tyres too, having a good look at them. And as we move around to the back of the car, once again factory colour coded spoiler being the XR6 with our high mount stoplight in the actual uh, in the spoiler itself. Um, looking at the rear bumper bar and everything, a couple of really minor little cosmetic marks on it. But once again, as I mentioned earlier, fairly consistent with the age of the vehicle. Overall, for a car approaching seven years old, it actually presents really well. As we get around the passenger side now, um, our, our left-hand rear alloy wheel in really good order. There is a minor mark just here near our fuel door. Um, don't know if that would polish out, but uh, as we scan down, our rear door and our left-hand front door present quite well. Um, the only other thing to point out, there are some minor little scuff marks on our left-hand front alloy wheel, consistent with having said hello to a gutter at some stage of its life. Uh, but the overall condition for a 2009, as I mentioned, uh, is fairly impressive. Around at the front of the car now, um, we'll have a little bit of a chat about the performance of the car. Uh, powered by the tried and true 4 litre 6 cylinder motor, the Ford. It's going to give us 195 kilowatts of power and 390 newton, newton metres of torque, but still deliver quite good economy, 10.5 litres combined per 100 k's. Um, so about 650 kilometres out of a tank of fuel based on a 68 litre fuel tank. Back around at the rear of the XR6 now and uh, we'll have a good look in the boot fairly good size to it as well. Notice the gas struts are on the outside so it doesn't impede our storage area and really roomy roomy size. As you can see our, our spare wheel, it's a space saver spare wheel with a brand new tyre, then all of our tools there as well. Just a timber cover and then our carpet drops back down. In the event that we need additional storage we can drop the second row seats down as well. So here we are inside the XR6 now and uh, presents really well the interior, fairly impressed. Um, on our driver's armrest, all of our power window and power mirror controls. And then moving into the steering wheel section, height and reach adjustable our steering wheel. Set yourself up where you're nice and comfortable, lock it into position, really simple operation. All of our cruise control settings on our right hand side and all of our uh, audio audio buttons and Bluetooth on the left hand side. As you can see, being an XR6, the distinctive blue uh, on the actual dashboard uh, illuminates really well at night time. Just on our right hand side, we've got our buttons just to control our, uh, our odometer and our menu just set over speed and things like that. Uh, 150,000 Ks, so good Ks for its age, this car. Um, and then just a button to uh, select our readout on, on our uh, little screen there as well. How much fuel we're using, distance to empty, average economy and so on. Then moving into the centre section, uh, our multifunction screen here, which does show us um, what we're doing as far as our climate control air conditioning or heating. Uh, quite cold in Berwick this morning, so we've got our heater running and it's nice and warm in here, it's beautiful. Gives us a readout of what station we're listening to as well, or obviously if you're playing a CD, it will feed that information as well. Uh, down below, as we mentioned, uh, climate control, air conditioning and heating. So we just set our temperature to exactly what we want, hit our automatic button and it does it all for you. Um, all of our master controls for our audio system, a manual lock and unlock button there, 
uh, traction control button and then a, a button here to turn our interior lights on and off. Little storage compartment there, quite deep in there, pop all your coins in or something. And then down below that, uh, 12 volt outlet there on our left hand side and an auxiliary, auxiliary plug there as well. Five speed sports auto, we can drive it as a normal automatic or flick it across to the left and drive it in what, what's called performance mode, which enables us to change through the gears just by the use of the lever. Uh, handbrake to the right hand side, cup holders behind that and a really generous storage area here as well. Also notice we've got an auxiliary plug here uh, just to plug any device like an iPod or something in if you need to. Now we'll just scan around the interior, have a look at the condition of the seats and the carpets in this car and it's probably where you'd think to yourself, you know what, that can't have done 150,000 k's. It's just too clean inside. Uh, presentation is excellent, does have driver and passenger airbag still is a five-star ANCAP safety rated this car as well so an extremely safe family car. So in summary a really nice example of a 2009 Ford Falcon XR6 sedan just recapping a four litre motor delivering 195 kilowatts of power 391 newton meters of torque and still delivering 10 and a half litres combined per 100 k's impressive car price range car um, you'll be really impressed with the drive as well so give us a call on 9907055 so that we can assist you further